I'm Anthony Azaro. And I'm Sophie Bennett. Welcome to Hamped Up. Ready for this? This week on Hamped Up, we explore how NHS student athletes are training in the off season, specifically two programs. One, a student run conditioning academy, and the other, how the football coaches are taking advantage of the year round coaching allowance. We headed over to Northampton High School to spend the morning with Jack Power and the Jack Power Baseball Academy to see how they've been using, utilizing their off season time this year. Uh, we started this program last fall around this time. We wanted to uh, build chemistry with our younger players and really get us going for the uh, coming season that we unfortunately lost, lost due to COVID. Uh, Jack, do you plan on continuing this program into the future? No. Yeah, I think if we can build some strong young players like our sophomores and juniors who can continue this when uh, class of 2021 graduate, I think we can have a pretty strong team. Do you think this program will provide momentum for you and the team going into the upcoming season? For sure, we're definitely looking to make a run at the uh, Western Mass Chip. I think we have a really strong team this year and we can definitely compete for a championship. Well, thank you so much, Jack. Thank you. We're with Will Shaw to ask him some questions about JPA. Since starting JPA, what part of your game has specifically gotten better other than your beautiful beard? Uh, you know, as a team, we've gotten faster, stronger, more explosive. Do you feel more confident in your game since starting JPA and how you'll perform next season? Yeah, definitely. It's good to get the offseason work in, uh, get in shape for the upcoming season. I think we got a shot at the championship next year. Since fall sports have started, where are you playing golf this year? How's it going and uh, what's your handicap? It's going great. You know, I pretty much just go out there and hit like, you know, 400 yard drives. Uh, I think my handicap's like minus three. Minus three. That's a good score. Good score. Rookie score, but good one. We also headed over to one of the football team's off-season trainings after school to see how they've been doing and talk to a few key members of their team. Do you think the more structured preseason will benefit the team in spite of the fact that the season is starting months later than it usually would? Uh, yeah, you know, we got new QB1, a bunch of new kids playing, and it'll only help them, you know, get together and start playing better. What are you looking for in your team as one of this year's captains? Um, you know, this year I think it's really important that we focus and stay together as a team. You know, we got a lot of new players that haven't seen the field, so we're going to have to really commit and focus to what we want to do if we want to win some games. Now that football is in the floating fourth season, will you be participating in any fall sports this season? Um, I was going to play soccer for Hopkins Academy, but now I'm not because we're doing this. Do you think these early practices are going to help you fulfill the role of QB1 this year? I think these new practices will help a lot because there's a lot of new players and you need to like get better chemistry with them, like bond with them, like really figure out what their skills are and like how you can use them to their fullest potential. Dominic, do you have any concern with the amount of new team members? This year we have a lot of new players and they come from a variety of sports backgrounds, but I think their athleticism and all their different sports will really help us on the field. Team chemistry may be a problem, but I think this additional season in the fall will really help with that and really help us bond as a team. With so many graduating seniors last year that played really key roles, who do you think is going to have to step up this season to really fill those? I think with so many graduating seniors last year, I think the sophomores are really going to help up front with the offense and defensive line. And I also think the juniors are going to help in the secondary. 